Hey, welcome back everybody. It's Fez again and we are concluding the uh, Blakestone Aliens of Gold walkthrough on the veteran agent difficulty for the PC using the B-Stone engine. So we are on the secret, or if you want to call it floor 10, of the first uh, mission. That's what we're doing today. So uh, it's not too terribly bad. There are a couple tight spots, I guess, if you want to call it that. But all in all, it's not too bad. It's not as fun as the... Uh, um, the first secret level, but it's not bad. It's definitely kind of fun. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, get started with it. And uh, next one will be mission two. So uh, um, if you already haven't, please like and subscribe. I could use the views and uh, all the fans I can get. Make me uh, make more of these videos for your uh, viewing entertainment and pleasure. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so uh, we are on uh, 410 Secret Alien Chamber, so let's blast open the uh, elevator door. Take out these uh, informants here. They may be good for you, I don't know. But right off the bat, there's a secret. We'll just go ahead and start pushing walls. There's a whole bunch of them around here, so... Uh, and quite a few Xylon Orbs, too. So let's go ahead and keep pushing walls, get the gold Xylon Orbs and whatever might be around. So keep pushing... There we go. Next one. More gold. Right, there we go. There's the next wall. Lots of island orbs. There is one uh, robot around here. Just one, not bad. I think it's past this room, I think, if I'm not mistaken. There he is. All right. And Xylon Orbs. couple more, I think. Not much more in this area. There we go. Okay, I think that's about it. So we'll go ahead and get back to the starting point. It's a pretty significant secret here, just so you know. Make sure I didn't forget anything. Here we go. There's the beginning. All right, so now we'll open these blue doors up, get our quad blaster out, take out this turret, and we'll go ahead and get our plasma gun out, and we'll take out these plasma aliens. There's one more over here. All right, take out this turret. Blast open that canister. All right, I'll take out that pot alien there. All right, so what we'll do now is take out gold fire. Grab some drinks, some fizzy drinks for the road. We'll open this door right over here. It's one that's straight across from our openings area, if you want to call it that. We'll go down this blue hallway, take out these pot aliens and drones. Maybe better to. Ow! I'm not dead. Watch out for those drones. Okay, so now we'll open this door right here. There's a couple sandwiches if you need it. Now, ammo can be a problem on this level. There's just not a lot of it. We'll take out the Star Sentinels and the Troopers and Sentrymen. Bite. 
All right, there's a secret along this wall. This wall, I'm sorry. There it is. Taking all those uh, drones. Grab the raw meat. Random raw meat on the floor. I'm sure it's very sanitary and tasty. All right, so once all that is grabbed, we'll go ahead and exit out this side over here where the uh, sentinels and troopers and whatnot are at. All right, we'll take out these turrets. Easier said than done sometimes, I guess. All right, blast open that canister and take out that last fat imp. Ah, no, what did I do? Okay, that wasn't right. Okay, yeah, something jacked up there, but I'm okay now, I think. All right, so now we're gonna go on to the secret, another secret area, right in the middle there, and we'll get our plasma cannon out. Let's go ahead and start blasting away, because there's plasma aliens, pod aliens, fat imps, uh, you name it. Oh, I hate those plasma aliens. Hate them. Okay, so we're out of ammo, but that's okay because there is a secret right here with uh, medical packs and ammo and everything we need. So, yay. Very nice. Don't forget the single gold bar there that could be easy to miss. All right, so on this wall right here, on the east side of this area, there's a second wall to open. And there are more monsters, pot aliens, some uh, Shreks, and some plasma aliens. And a couple of robots, too, for good measure. All right, so be careful of those uh, aliens there, those plasma aliens, because they suck. All right, there is a secret around here somewhere. There he is. There we go. All right, so stock up right here. It's on the east side of this, and take out those stinking drones because they suck. All right. I think that's about everything. I'm pretty sure. Oh, there was a robot. Well, I'm glad I checked that. All right. So that area is cleared out. So now we'll go over here. This should look familiar. We killed Goldfire in this area a minute ago. We'll open this door up here, get the quad blaster out, and take out the turrets. There's quite a few turrets in this area, so just be on your guard. Take out the fat imp. All right. He's guarding some ammunition there, so grab it if you need it. Take out the turrets. Right, there's one more turret around here. There we go. All right, there's a secret around here, so let's go ahead and push on it. Grab all the gold that you see here. All right, just keep pumping the walls, see if there's something around here that might push open. Okay, there we go. Take out that stupid mech there. To be honest, I may need to grab some more health. I'm not doing all that hot right now, I don't think. Oh, goodness. All right, I think there's another mech here out here somewhere. I thought there was another mech. It could be wrong. Okay, I was right. That's it. All right, I think that's it for this area. So we'll back out here. Oh, man. These, this maze is kind of... Uh, I'm not a fan of this kind of secret. It's easy to get lost. All right. There we go. Out of here. And there's another secret on this wall. There we go. Yeah, not much. Just a few gold bars, I guess. All 
Alright, so all monsters are destroyed, and we just got a whole bunch of coins to get. Let's go ahead and grab it. And some Xylon Orbs, and Gold Bars, and just a bunch of random ass treasure. And that's it! That's all the treasure. That's all the monsters, so we can just mosey on out of here then. Alright, so we'll go back to the elevator. But wait, there's more! Alright. So what I'll do now is I'll go to this elevator now, and we're going to watch the conclusion of this episode. So let's go ahead and hit 9. Alright, so we'll see our stats for this whole mission. So I got a 100% floor rating and a 97% mission rating. So all things considered, not bad. 100% um, would have been best, but, you know, I'm, I'm not complaining. So I killed a couple of uh, informants I shouldn't have, but that's just the way the ball bounces sometimes. So we'll go ahead, we'll open this door here. Um, ooh, well, not that I really need it, but Goldfire comes around. There he is. I better stay out of his way. Open this door. And there is a door. This one right here, it's marked in red, right here. That's the exit. So, uh, end of the mission. Great work, Blake. You've completed this mission. <laughs> Early 90s graphics at its finest. Mission 1 successful. British intelligence, slow band encoded transmission. Bloody good work, Blake. You've severely crippled Goldfire's legion of mutants and destroyed the first of his dreaded guardian ally, aliens. You've removed the threat of Goldfire's forceful grip on Ceylon, ensuring its peaceful existence. With the fall of the Star Institute, Goldfire has accelerated his plans to unleash the legions of killer mutants and is fortifying his defenses against any further attacks. Your orders are highly classified and urgent. Repeat, urgent. You must proceed to the floating fortress and attack before his defenses are fully in place to ensure complete success of this mission. Final orders will be transmitted upon arrival at the fortress. End transmission. Alright, so I can put my name on the wall for high scores. Yay! Alright, so that's the conclusion of uh, mission one so i hope you enjoyed this walkthrough we'll start mission two at some point so again please like and subscribe share with your friends family and uh, above all else stay safe so uh until then take care everybody god bless